what is going on everybody we are live with some euro truck simulator let's bring tiktok into this little environment let's go live over there too and let's do it hopefully everyone's having a fantastic weekend and let's see we good to go here hopefully the audio doesn't cut out like yesterday i have it i have it so i can hear it on that computer so we'll have to see. Uh, first off, let's see what we're doing here. Are we gonna do freight market or are we gonna do twenty eight thousand? Well, that's a long job though. Holy jeez, twenty eight thousand. That's the that's probably the highest one we've ever seen. What's going on for quick job right now? Where am I? Eleven thousand. Hold on, sort, sort by price. 10,000, seven, I mean, I got a freight market of 28,000. Let's see what this one is. This one's a little, this one's the same amount of money, but shorter distance. This is from France to Germany. 90, oh, 90 bucks a mile. I mean, we have to do the $90 a mile, right? And that's kind of, it's kind of makes sense. We need the money. All right, we gotta pay down these loans. I say we start with this one. Do Strasbourg to Salzburg, and uh, so we go. Toy, what's going on, man? How are you? Uh, you're about to set for. Oh no! Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What am I doing here? Let's go to my quick travel to there. Hold on. World map. Yeah, see, I'm not near there right now. I'm over here. So if I go to, was it Strasbourg? Okay, hold on. Quick travel. The quick travel to here, how much is it? That's fine. How much money we're gonna quick travel here? Let's do this. Finding Let's do this. Let's see, job market, freight market, is it still available? It is still available. Now we could do it. Um, let's see. You're about to have a heavy haul job. Review your current truck configuration. Yeah, I mean we're gonna do it anyway. I don't care. Drive we'll safe. hopefully our truck can handle it. Um, go to our map here. All right, let's get out of here. We got one mile until we go pick up the uh, our right. our trailer here. This is the first time I'm using my new wheel with your truck simulator. So we'll see how we do. I said I'm pretty sure I set all the buttons that I need, but as obviously as we uh oh no, I just realized I figure out which button I don't have. Stay right. Okay, we'll have to right. figure that. Hold on. Do, 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 do. Options, key bindings. It's the uh which one is it? Trolls. H pattern shifter. Where's the button to change to the next? Oh, here it is. Um, shifter toggle needs to be that. There we go. So basically, I run through my six gears, and then I have to switch to my seventh. Let's see if it actually works. Yeah, okay, that's what I need. Turn right. Oh, I gotta go right. All right, we'll get this. I mean, I... I learned all the buttons on the old wheel. And now I'm trying to like, you know, fix my brain to know that there's new buttons and there are new places. Then turn left. Turn left. I can't believe we're about to do a twenty-seven thousand dollar job. Get ready to. Turn. Get ready to turn left. 
Rip. Rip. I know, right? You have arrived at your destination. Uh, let's see if this button works your now. Guidance is now finished. Should be this one. There we go. Great market. $28,000 job right here. Pick up this trailer. Yeah, we're going to do it. Hopefully my truck can handle it. Where's the trailer? That one? Okay. I mean, I've pulled these trailers before, so I don't know why it's acting all weird about it. Back up, get our trailer. And that should be this button. Yes, it is. Okay, we're doing good on the button so far. 308 miles ahead of us, guys. Come on. Turn that. Seven hours and fifty two minutes of game time is this journey. Let's see how we do with it. We have plenty of gas. Hopefully most of it's highway, so we could just cruise, but I guess we'll find out. This will be the true test here. Okay, hold on. This is what happened last time. All right, car, I'm coming back. See if I can make it up this hill. Talk about clutch control. <laughs> Peace, thanks for the lightning bolts. Jesse, what's going on, man? Come on. We're, we're creeping forward. I'm trying not to let go of the clutch too much. Here we go. Here we go. Again, this is a heavy haul. It's made for probably a more powerful truck than what I have, but it's $28,000. Beast, thanks for the share. I feel like my right leg is cramping. Come on, we could do it. I don't want to shift. I'm going to stay in first gear. Oh, we made it. There we go. Oh, I'm ready for the race. I am ready. I love that the uh, Toyotas sh did not show up in practice. And then there's like five Toyotas in the top 10. <laughs> oh, I love it. It's like they tricked the competition. Like, oh, Toyotas are not running well. And then qualifying comes and boom, they show up. Truck stuck. Yeah, no toy. Uh, we managed to get up that hill though. I'm like easing out of the clutch to try not to lose it. And luckily we got up the hill. So that's all that matters. All right, now we can cruise. If you guys are new to the channel, obviously slam on the like button, hit the follow button, hit the subscribe button. Um, on Sundays, we talk NASCAR. We talk everything. We talk food.
Uh, hope for a Chastain win. Oh, come on, man. Chastain? Oh, listen, he won it last time, right? It was a, it was a cool ending last time when, uh, who was it? Bowman and someone else were battling and Chastain just kind of went around him. Which is basically what happened yesterday. Also, Larson got the win because two people, first and second, were battling and he was in third. And he went around him. I guess that's what I'm going to do, though. I mean, this was a $28,000 job. Remember yesterday you raced in Bristol Heat? Yes, I did. And we'll be doing some more racing tomorrow night. NASCAR. So this is our truck right now. Got a big tanker. I don't know what's in it. I didn't check. Big old air horns on the top. What are we hauling? Uh, ammonia. It's 26 tons of ammonia. For $28,000. Cautions every two laps. Yep. That's the way it goes, man, at Bristol. I'm liking this new wheel. I liked all the the buttons I have on here. Obviously, they're like it's there's pictures of like a windshield wiper, there's pictures of a light, there's pictures of a blinker, which my old wheel did not have. Which I uh, which I like. I just don't know why the little screen isn't working. I gotta figure that out. Drop down a gear here. Two hundred and sixty-two miles. We did about fifty miles already. It's pretty good. So, like I was saying, I think I'm just going to travel around. I'll just quick travel. I spent a thousand euros to get to Strasbourg for quick travel, but if it's going to result in a twenty-eight thousand dollar job, well, then obviously that makes sense. Because if I did a job from the city that I was in in Italy, it was only like eleven thousand. So spend a thousand to make twenty eight. Sounds pretty smart to me. I mean we don't have much money as it is. We only have twenty nine hundred euros. Whoa! Oh I'm sorry, was I going too slow for you? I have twenty six tons of pneumonia. Pneumonia <laughs> Ammonia <laughs> in my truck. Yeah, I have pneumonia. I'm carrying around a uh an infection of pneumonia. <laughs> Oh man, it's early. Had a long night. A very long night. Get ready to turn right. So far the sound's been working though. So I think I figured it out, which is good. I don't have to sit there restarting the audio engine every two seconds. Turn right. Yeah, I'm working for the CDC. <laughs> Just got 26 tons of pneumonia. Just traveling around with it. No problems here. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, let's 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 refocus our attention here. 234 miles, five hours and 37 minutes. 2,900 euros in the bank. Hopefully a loan payment doesn't hit because, uh, you know, we'll go negative and the bank will start yelling. Uh, I just want to know how you get 80,000 pounds of pneumonia. <laughs> I bought it at Costco. Costco sells it. Turn right. I love my little blinker buttons. I love them. 
Yeah, it's it's right next to the uh, cookie aisle at Costco, the pneumonia aisle. 561 from Noah. Thanks, dude. Thanks for your con contribution to our company. Pick up your Costco hot dog and your well pounds. Uh, toy, I said, let me see what I'm hauling. And I said pneumonia instead of ammonia. Obviously, pneumonia is when you're sick, you got fluid in your lungs. So I said, I'm carrying around 26 tons of pneumonia. So people on TikTok are making jokes. And I said, yeah, you could buy the pneumonia at, uh, at Costco. But uh, yeah, Toy, don't forget, I stream to TikTok and YouTube. So if it seems like I'm talking to myself, it's probably because I'm talking to TikTok. And obviously vice versa. I can imagine people think that sometimes. Like, what is he talking about? Who's he talking to? It's like, oh, TikTok people. I think my truck is holding up pretty well to this. I mean, I, again, I don't know why it made such a big deal about a heavy haul when maybe because the actual job requirement was a heavy, you'll get a bonus for it. But I'm like, it's only 26 tons. I've hauled 26 tons before. Do I get a free drink with my pneumonia? <laughs> yeah, it's a dollar fifty hot dog with a drink and a, a and a tanker of pneumonia. I guess that's going to be the joke of the stream today. Come on. Oh, you're going to break check me? You're really going to break check me? Wow. Okay. All right. I see you. I see you. Get out of the way. I got places to go. Sounds like a great deal. I can't deal with this person anymore. See ya. Passing ya. Hundred and sixty. Wow, we're almost halfway done. Hundred and sixty-two miles to go. I like that most of it's highway, right? So, which button is it? This button? Yeah, okay. Change my map, which you guys can't see. Okay, that's great. I gotta change that for YouTube. You're good now, YouTube. I fixed it so you can see the mini map. Okay. Crush his cars, you switch like No, 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 listen. He he hit the brakes. Okay. He knew I want to come over. Is this him flying up now though? Is this the same car flying up? Look at this, he's back. He just flew up in the middle lane. Okay, we got some aggression today with these drivers. Why weren't you going that fast when I was behind you? I don't understand. Why did you have to make me pass you for you to then find the gas pedal? Let's 
drop a gear and disappear. Pull a Dale scene. <laughs> Listen, I gave him plenty of room, I think. It might have been a little tight. I'm not gonna lie. It might have been a little tight, but it's okay. We didn't we didn't get into an accident and there was no trailer damage. That's all that matters. You have new mail, loan installment. Oh, I'm negative money. No. 5,700 was paid. I'm negative 2,200 euros. All right, we gotta get this job done quick. Coming over, I got my blinker on. You can't yell at me. getting off here no so what am I doing why did I, the arrows on GPS told me to get over thinking that like we were getting off the exit soon confusing me here so Jesse who do you think's gonna win it though I know you want Chastain to win but who do you think's actually gonna win I think it's gonna be Ty Gibbs Tyler Reddick um, maybe Byron. That's who I think is going to win the race today. At Coda. Probably Larson, to be honest. You think so? I mean, I hope not. Actually, I, at this point, I don't want that many winners, right? You, you want to keep the winners under the 16 so that points don't come into play. So I guess if we can have some repeat winners, that's okay. Stay left. Stay left. Got it. Thank you. I love the sound mod that I put in. Uh, he's been fast as hell all season. Yeah, he has. I think Denny Hamlin's gonna win. I mean, listen, now that it's uh, it's a road course, there's obviously stages now, so anything can happen. Literally anything can happen. We'll have to wait and see. The truck race was fun. Corey Heim took it. Same. Xfinity race was good. Larson took it. But we'll see what happens today. 60 miles left on this trip guys 60 miles left wonder where we're gonna go to next i'm excited to just travel around do a little honk to my fellow trucker what's going on you're my, uh, you're my, my, your man, your man. I thought it said your mama at first. What's up, buddy? How are you? What's going on today? We're over here doing a little Euro truck sim. As always on Sunday mornings. There's a car over there. Ooh, it's on accident. I almost forgot which button changes my camera back. I was like, I can't see. <coughs> <coughs> We're good on fuel for right now. We might have to uh, actually probably could get some fuel. Hold on. Let's get some fuel. Let's just fill it up while we're here. Oh, wait, I can't fill it up. I have no money. What what happens if I try to do it? Do I go negative more or does it say you have no money? Oh, I can do it. Okay. I guess that would be silly, right? If you had no available money. 
and it wouldn't let you fill your tank up. Why are you going broke? Uh, my loan payment came out. What's up, Sean? How are you? Yeah, my loan payment came out, and uh, I didn't have enough money. Don't forget, at the end of the last episode, we paid off that other loan. So we have one loan left, and we're on a $28,000, sorry, 28,000 euro job. So we'll have money very shortly. All right, but we got fuel, so we're good. You can tell the truck struggles to get going. I'm not going to lie. I mean, this does need a little bit more of a beefier truck. But I'm still capable of doing it. I just hope there's no more hills. Because uh, we struggled on that first hill. But 22 miles left to go of this trip. We'll get paid. And if we do a couple more of these $28,000 jobs, guys, that... $400,000 loan will be paid off real quick. Damn non-American currency. Dude, it's so hard for me to say euro instead of dollar. Eventually, I'm just going to give up, right? I'm just going to say, screw it. It's 2800 bucks. Call it a day. And, you know, you people can figure it out. But I do my best to say euro because it is Euro Truck Simulator. But it's not like I have flocks of Europeans in here watching me play to call me out on it. So it's okay. <laughs> tunnel you know what that means oh it doesn't add the echo effect all right we're getting off here seven miles to go um, stay right and then exit right exit right I get my blinker on so I don't hit anybody. Salzburg. You can find them in the F1 streamers chat. Yeah, I know. 100% that's where they are. Ugh, come on. Sorry if you're behind me. I have an underpowered truck for this. One mile to go. They want to race? I almost hit the guardrail. Oh my god. Whoa. Turn right. Oh, watch out, camper. We have made it with no damage. I gotta admit, guys, this was a pretty easy trip here for 28,000. Wonder where we're going to next. Stop. Enter. 40 XP. Yeah, we could do that one. We can knock out this one. All right, here. This is easy. If I turn the wheel the right way. Hold on.
Back it up, nice and slow. There it is. Pay me. First job of the day complete. $28,576, guys, with 909 XP. I will take that all day long. All right, so we got 25000 in the bank right now. We have a $314,000 loan. Um... So if we could get our money up to 200,000, we could then take this for a hundred thousand bucks and lower the installment payment. Okay. Oh yeah. All right. So let's see where we're we going to next guys. I'm all about this traveling around 35,000. Well, that's a long trip though. Jeez. But $65. Should we do this long one? I got to get it from Zurich and get it over to Warclaw. All right, so let's travel to. Let's do it. I mean, thirty-five thousand, right? Why not? Unless there's shorter ones. Oh, we got this one with the ferry. That's twenty-eight thousand. Eighty-three. Actually, that might be the best bet. That's eighty-three dollars a mile. And where do I gotta go? Turney? Can I can, can I fast travel to Turney? I don't think I can. Quick travel. Where was that? Was that? Oh, I can't quick travel to Turney. Oh, man. Okay, so I can't go there. Um, Freight market. Where else can I go? Hold on. Price per distance. 83. For 25,000. I can do another 25,000 one. Just stay in Germany. I really want to do the one with the uh, the ferry, this one, but I can't I can't get the tourney. What's this one? No, now we're just losing money. All right, so we're gonna travel to Frankfurt if I can. Let's see, quick travel, Frankfurt. I can. Uh, oh, it's only six hundred and twenty euros. Yeah, we're gonna do that one. That's cheap. That's a quick. That's a cheap quick travel. All right, so then we have to go to. Let's see here job market freight market 25,000 right yep okay pick this one let's All go right. let's see where we got to pick this thing up from I like that it fast travels you to a like dealership just in case you need repairs I just like that I got some money in my in my pocket now you know what I'm saying all right, so we got six miles until we go pick this up. And it's just going to be a uh, single country. We're not going to be crossing borders or anything. All right, Jesse, thanks for stopping by, man. I appreciate it. Hopefully you enjoy the race later on. I know you will. And we'll see you on the next one tomorrow, hopefully, for NASCAR. You're full sending. Hopefully this job is still available when I get there. That's the only thing. These jobs expire in a certain amount of time if you don't get them. So I would hate to have to drive there and then it, it's gone. It's only a couple miles away, so we should be okay. And don't forget, as you drive without a trailer, if you just drive around the city or something, you're earning experience points, which helps you level up anyway. So that's always good. 
Stay right, and then turn right. I'm liking these big jobs, though. Stay left. You're late, a little late on that, dude. A little late on the stay left. I had to lock him up there for a second. hauling was it another tank I didn't even see I did not even pay attention to see what it was or no it was the uh no that was the other thing right it wasn't tractors One mile away. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. I hate that change camera button, back button. Change camera back button when I'm turning I'm like where is it I don't want to hit the uh I don't want to hit something as I'm turning turn right Cross that this is still available for us. Here we are, safe and sound. Here we are, safe and sound. All right, let's see. Freight market 20. Oh, it's gone. It is gone. Man, is there anything else in the area? That stinks. I didn't, really, I didn't pay attention to how. Oh, what's the next one? See, it expires in 23 minutes. This expires in 16 hours. I, mean, I can't get there. That stinks. Um, I could do this one. It expires in five hours. How quick is the... That's the thing. Like, how fast is the quick travel? Say quick travel. It doesn't tell you how long it takes. Let's try this one. See if we can go here. I want these big jobs. I'm not going to mess around with the $11,000 jobs anymore. All right. So now we go to job market, freight market here. It expires in five hours. Okay. So we should have plenty of time. 22,000. What's this one? This, no, this is 83 a mile. This is what we need. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's go. Ready to roll. This is 20 minutes away. We should be able to get to this one before it expires. I was so mad. What was that other one? 28,000? 26,000? This one's a little bit less money, but it's okay. Turn left. Is it? Like, I don't know why it's so hard for me to find the, the 
button. Go straight. I'll get the buns eventually. Like I said, first day with this new wheel in this game, so. Don't hit the Mini Cooper. What are you doing? You stopping for me? Okay. Thanks, I guess. Didn't have to, but I'll take it. Stay left and then turn left. Turn left. Three miles to go, guys. On a little bit of a highway here. Stay left. Stay left on the road. Stay right. Then turn right. <laughs> Stay left, and then turn left. Turn left. Crazy driver right now. All you hear is the tires just screeching. I don't even mean to do it. Come on, green light. Thank you. Like, make a right, make a left, make a left, make a right. What's up, KB? How you doing? How you, uh... How we feeling today? How's everything going? Welcome to the stream. My name is Jay Pace. I'm doing Euro Truck Simulator. Live on YouTube and on TikTok. Follow me, follow me. What's up right now? If I get here and this job expired also, it said five hours, so we should have plenty of time. Here. Can I go into gear? Jeez. Turn right. I feel like you do a lot of. It's like NASCAR. Turn left. Fine. I know, right? <laughs> exactly, Sean. Not today, though. We got road course today. We're excited about this, right? We're happy. All right. Fingers crossed that this job is still here. Twenty-two thousand ish. Yes, it is. 83.94 a mile. Take job. Okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. Which is it? This, this first one here? Yeah. Doing a lot of tankers today, guys. That's what. That's where the money is. Moving the fuel, or whatever this is. Hopefully, it's not pneumonia again. <laughs> Sorry, ammonia. <laughs> Oh, man. All right. Couple that, please. Thank you. <clears throat> All right. We have uh, six hours and 31 minutes to go on this one. <clears throat> Let's do this. And I didn't get a warning about a heavy haul, so we should be okay. Take a look at this tank real quick. This is what we're hauling. And gate is opening for us, which is good. Pull up to the front here, look right, look left. See you later. 263 miles. It's almost equivalent to the job we just did. That one was 306 miles. 
We've got a nice little long haul here. Going up a hill. Fingers crossed. I'll keep it in fifth gear. Turn left. I'm just going to assume it's a green light for me because everyone stopped. But I stopped kind of far and I couldn't see the light. Hopefully a lot of it's on the highway again. It makes things go by much quicker. Oh, what are we hauling? Kerosene. 23 tons of kerosene. Oh, okay. So actually I, that makes sense. And this is 23 tons. The job I had prior to this was 26 tons. So it was three extra tons, which is probably why it was telling me that, you know, this requires a heavy haul. Got it. Okay. We're good. Because I was like, I always do 26. Maybe I always do 23. And that's why it gave me the warning. I mean, listen, our truck still handled it. We got the $28,000. Um, but yeah. I think, did a loan payment come out? We're not, whoa, why are you yielding? Come on, man. What are you slowing down for? Uh, wasn't the last job 28,000? Oh, we were negative money, right? That's why. Okay, never mind. It's all coming back to me now, just like the song says. We're not going to roll backwards. Uh-oh. Go! get on the highway we need to get on the highway so we can start knocking out some of these miles Cameron what's going on man how are you we are doing some heavy haul in Euro truck simulator right now having fun making money work my way up to that million dollar company we are on our second pull right now made about 28,000 euros on the first one Looking at about 23,000 on this one. Let's see, um, this button, yeah. So it looks like we're gonna be on the highway for the bulk of our trip. Looks like we have a little bit of a entrance ramp coming up here in a second. Oh, nice, man. Hopefully you got a good night's sleep. Income, 1,400 euros from Raphael, which is good. Uh, we go got to go straight. Okay. So that's a little more money in our pocket. It's not much, 1,400, but it'll cover fuel costs. So I'll take it. I'm imagining I'll probably have to fill up. I probably will fill up when I get to the new place. Is this going to be 300 miles? Almost 300 miles. Uh, we delivering out here, making money. I've seen this game a few times, but it's satisfying. It is satisfying. It's very relaxing. 
like nascar is like you're on edge right i'm constantly trying to draft people and pass people but this is like you know you just sit back and you cruise i mean it's great Uh, we're hauling a big tank uh tanker truck right now give you a quick little view of it this is what we're hauling right now so we'll get there uh 237 miles left of this delivery of kerosene 23 tons of it but i mean just think guys once we do this we'll have like 40 something thousand in the bank as long as they don't smash into a wall again like the first time then we won't have to dish out 60 grand to fix our truck. Uh, I mean, obviously, the main goal is to pay off that big loan, right? That's what we want to do. We want to pay off that big loan so we can get another garage or more drivers or upgrade our current garage, whatever it is. But we got to pay off that $400,000 loan first. Relax until you hit something. That's right, Sean. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm talking about. It's great until you hit something and then you're like, oh, there goes all my money. But so far we've been pretty good. I mean, we've been since that one incident. We haven't really uh, been in any accidents, so it's been good. And first of all, Sean, I'm pretty sure you were here for it. The game glitched, right? I was backing up, and the game just glitched and smashed me into the other trailer. Uh, oh, should have smashed to the wall. We have, yeah, just keep moving. No, uh, Cameron, I was backing up into one of the slots in between two trucks when making the delivery. And the game glitched or something, and it jackknifed my trailer. And it caused like $60,000 worth of damage, which is how much I had in my bank account at the time. So I was like, uh, okay, well, I guess we have to use all of it. And we, used, we basically used all of our little savings that we had to fix my truck. So I was pretty pissed off. But since then, we've been pretty good. We've been cruising, doing big jobs, making good money. Like I said, we just did a $28,000 job. Now we're about to do a $22,000, $23,000 job. And we'll see what uh, we get after that one. Yeah, one insurance claim, except there is no insurance claims in this. I don't know. Actually, I don't know why there isn't. Like, you should have the option of getting, like, an insurance plan. But you don't. Like, everything is just out of pocket. You go to a local dealership, and they just charge you for everything. Already down to 180 miles left of this journey. Fuel is still good. I thought I was going to have to fuel up, but I forget how many miles I get on a full tank. I want to say it's like 500-ish. Something like that. So I don't think I'll be able to pay off that loan today. Like I said, if I do the math in my head, I have to get about $200,000 in the bank take the hundred thousand dollar loan pay off the big loan that makes my monthly payment or daily payment drop from 57.88 to like two thousand bucks so we're already we're working it down but i still gotta make two hundred thousand dollars so we'll see if we can get close to that today i don't know depends what type of jobs we find i mean if i keep doing these twenty eight thousand twenty five thousand dollar jobs then uh then we might be good I mean, if you're doing four jobs, eight jobs, you know, and you got your money. Okay, dude, let's, let's, you can keep moving. The loan right now is $317,000. I owe. I took out a $400,000 loan and a $100,000 loan to get my trucks. 
and uh and to get my garage upgraded so i'm trying to pay off all those loans before i make before i take out another loan to keep expanding uh ryan thanks for the follow man i appreciate it uh stay loaded backhaul as much as possible make the fuel worth your time yep true i mean that's the only thing smuggle though like you see that i'm skipping around right i'm, I'm fast traveling to places to have the bigger jobs because like for 600 euros for me to get a twenty-five thousand dollar job makes more sense than just doing an eleven thousand job from the place i'm at so i think i'm just gonna keep bouncing around to the big jobs and uh spending a little bit of money to fast travel which technically i probably should drive there but you know i mean also if you drive there you might miss the the cutoff window like we did on the last one right it expired before we got there 128 miles left on this one man this truck is struggling up the hills i'm gonna have to give myself some upgrades which is probably another reason why my other drivers don't do a lot of money what's going on here um their trucks aren't really that upgraded right so they can only do probably certain weights certain types of deliveries but i still think if i had the opportunity i'm going to upgrade my garage or get a second garage and then get two more drivers instead of i don't know what do you guys think do i do i max out my current garage add two more drivers or do i buy a second garage somewhere else and get two more drivers but it's going to be like a, a base level garage. I don't know. Do I just max out the one I have first? And then worry about getting a second one? Uh, we have other drivers. Do you have to service the engines too? Yeah, all the maintenance and the fuel and everything like that comes out of my money. Like when you do a... When you look at their log, because you can see their log of the jobs they do. You could uh, You can get a breakdown of how much was like maintenance and stuff, so... Yeah, all their like they get paid per mile and then I have to reimburse out of them for fuel and, and maintenance and stuff. So stay right. Then exit right. Exit right. Go straight. Go straight. Go straight. Stay right. <clears throat> I just feel like I want to get a, a garage down by like where the ferries are because like I said if you take those ferries back and forth your your time skipping and your workers are getting jobs done it's like a again it's like a hack it's not I mean it's an in-game hack basically because you could just take jobs back and forth and do 14 hour ferry trips and in those 14 hours your guys are getting multiple jobs done and you're just cranking money thank you for the sub on YouTube I appreciate that Um, so yeah, I don't know. I'll have to see when the time comes when I can take that $400,000 loan again. I guess we'll see what we wind up doing. But we're going to need employees and we're going to need trucks. And the trucks are about 115 plus 30, like $150,000 each for the trucks. So that's $300,000 right there. Wait, what uh, were the choices again? Sorry, one of the kids needs some. My choice is either. I have one garage right now with three drivers, right? And either I can max out that garage, it's $100,000 to upgrade the garage, and then I get two more drivers with a total of five drivers at the one garage. Or I try to buy a second garage somewhere else around the, in Europe, and then get two drivers there. So they're doing a different part of the country or countries. So I don't know. I want to get a garage in Italy because Italy will give me options to use the ferries and you know it might benefit me with uh the time lapse and stuff but I don't know I'm, I'm leaning more towards just upgrading my single garage max that out get them some solid trucks and then uh and then worry about building a second garage somewhere else my goal here is to get a million dollars in my bank account with no loans with as many garages and people as that takes. 
you know, I'm not using any mods or cheats or money hacks or anything like that. I'm just driving until I get a million dollars. But obviously I'm upgrading along the way. I'm getting them better trucks. I'm getting bigger garages. I'm getting more people. So again, this is not going to be a, a 20 episode series. It's probably going to be a hundred episode series, but that's fine. I get nothing but time, you know, nothing but time. Yeah, I know. I mean, again, like, again, I'm going to, at some point, I'm going to have 10 garages, right? I mean, that's the goal here. But I feel like if I max out this one first, I get two more drivers at it. Um, I think that would probably be the best bet right now. Jordan, what's going on, man? How are you? Oh, a little bit of an accident or something on the other side here, guys. A little bit of an accident. Stay left. Oh, three car pileup. Oh, we got something going on here, too. Oh! Oh no! Woof! Guys, I almost smashed into the back of that person. What are you doing here? Come on! What do you think about the Xfinity race finish? The Xfinity race finish was um, it, it, exactly how I expected it. Two cars smashing into each other towards the end and the third place person winning. Guys, I don't got time for this. They expect me Saturday between 8.30 p.m. and 10. And right now I'm going to get there at 19.20. So I'm a little early, but what's going on here? What do we stop for? Do a little rubber neck in here. What do we what do we stop for? Oh, someone's trailer fell off their truck. What's going on? Like, let some vehicles through. Jeez. All right, we're good now. I'm like, going to reverse? No. All right, we're good. We're back on track here. I don't know why everyone was just stopped there, though. Yeah, Larson just hovered back in third place, man. And then he, uh... Then he just took the win. Nice save there. Yeah, man, I was... I was too busy looking over, and by the time I switched the camera back, I'm like, slam on the brakes. All right, 32 miles left of this job, guys. Is this another accident? What happened here now? Oh, this is like a whole spill. Oh, it's a fire. Look at this, guys. Look at this, that trailer caught on fire. Oh my gosh. They're just trying to slow me down. I don't like the new restart. No, I'm not a fan of it either. What's with all the accidents today? I've never, I've never seen this many accidents on the highway. All right, let's get this delivered. Let's check our mail. It's probably the bank yelling at us because when we went negative money, we'll check on our other drivers and then we'll uh, we'll find another job to do. How's my trailer looking? Trailer's looking tight. Woo! My custom Scania. All right, we getting off here? Or are we still going straight? Still going straight. Okay. Jordan, who you got winning today? I think it's going to be Reddick or Gibbs. And that's not because I'm biased to Toyota, but I think it's going to be Reddick or Gibbs. Don't forget, guys, if you're on YouTube or TikTok watching, throw some follows down, hit the likes, and tap on the screen. I appreciate it. 
Yeah, guys, I'm streaming on YouTube and on TikTok. You can find me on YouTube, J Pace Racing on YouTube. If you want to check me out on TikTok, it's J Pace YT. J Pace YT. Get ready to turn left. Dortmund. Turn left. going we're going what happened I still gotta get used to my gear changing button like I said I get one through six and then I have to hit a button and then I get seven through twelve and I keep miss hitting the button because I'm not used to it yet so it's not switching to my high gears. Uh, I wonder if this game is free on console with the... Uh, Jordan, this game is not available on console at all. You want to see who survives after stage two? <laughs> yeah, we'll have to see. Yeah, this game is not on console. Only on PC. And I think that goes for American Truck Simulator also. I don't think they're on console. Oh, what are we going to find here? Is this a dealership? Is it a, a recruitment agency? Get ready to turn left. All right. We're almost at our destination here. Uh, and then whoever is up front, like two top two, might be the favorites. The whole race of no caution. Yeah, but don't forget we got the we got the stages, right? So the stages will bring people back together. Uh, my dad once explained that to me. He worked on some trucks for always thought the push button for high gears was interesting. Yeah, it's uh, like I said, uh, Cameron, this is this is definitely a full simulator here. Like I could do it without that. Like I could do. There's options for shifting that do like one, three, five, seven, nine, so I don't have to hit a button. But I kind of like hitting the button. I just have to get used to my new wheel and where that button is. So I'm stuck with uh, games like Farming Simulator and Zoo Simulator. Hey, listen, okay? I like my Planet Zoo game. Okay. All right, 90. Why? First of all, why is there no 90 XPs? Why is there all these 40s? Jordan, if you want, go on YouTube, find J-Pace Builds. If you like farm, if you like zoo simulators, you must like all the other building games I do. J-Pace Builds on YouTube. All right, let's see. See if we can back this up nice and quick without it glitching out. Oh, keep going. Ugh. As it's like I've done this before. You know what I'm saying? It's like I've done this. I don't have to do anything. Just slowly back up. First try. Maybe a little bit of an adjustment there. And there it is. Hit the button. Get the trailer off. And let's see what our payday looks like. Uh, we made it. Yeah, we did. My son is into building Jurassic World parks and roller coaster theme parks. Cameron, show him J Pace builds, man. Show him J Pace builds on YouTube. Okay, I got all that content. Uh, you should play Planet Coaster, dude. Planet Coaster is one of my favorites, Jordan. I gotta start getting into it. I've been playing Park Attack to go through the campaign, but Planet Coaster is one of my favorites. All right, so 22,715, 787 experience. We are about halfway to level 15, which is awesome. Obviously, as you progress through the levels, you get new engine upgrades, you get new parts for your trucks, you get all those cool things. We're sitting on a fat 48,958 euros right now, guys. Let's check our mail real quick. Let's do a little recap. So accounts overdrawn, we already knew that. We fixed that. Overdrawn has been settled. We're good. Let's check our drivers real quick. 
So Raphael is currently going from Lyon to Luxembourg. He's got 13 hours left. He's bringing some big bags of seeds. And Noah is going from Luxembourg to Strasbourg. He's doing some post packages for three hours left. Um, high value cargo, long distance, that's fine. Uh, 22,000, if this is true, I think I need to change career. <laughs> there you go. Um, so yeah, like, let's see. If I want to upgrade my garage, right? Right now it's a small. I can upgrade it to head two more spots, and it's how much? A hundred thousand. All right, so a hundred thousand to upgrade. I hire two drivers, and they need a hundred and fifty thousand dollars per truck. So that's two, uh, three. That's basically the whole loan. That would be literally a whole entire loan, four hundred thousand dollars. One fifty, one fifty, and then a hundred. So I would literally be taking out a whole nother four hundred thousand dollar loan. Right now we owe three hundred fourteen thousand on this one. So we got we got some work to do but uh do you like horse racing games horse racing games is there games that are horse racing i've never seen a horse racing game like what jordan let me uh look all the roads i've traveled it's pretty good i'm, I'm getting around guys See, we have to get up here we have to go up to uh we haven't gone to berlin yet Eventually we have to get over to here, Istanbul. We got a lot of places still to go. All right, freight market. Let's see what the highest job is. And it's 30,000, it expires in three hours. I have to pick it up from Salzburg. Or we could do a 38,000 and pick that up from Frank, that expires. It's all tankers though. Like why do we have to do tanks? So this one's 36,000, that's not bad. Expires in one hour. Oh, is that where I, oh i'm here we should do this one i'm already in the place 70 dollars a mile and it's uh some tractors change it up bar lap horse racing it's on console but i don't know about pc i'll take a look at it uh, i have to create a monopoly yeah you do cam oh we're gonna do this one guys we're gonna do thirty six thousand dollar uh some tractor deliveries let's go i'm tired of the tanks we need something different than a tank all right so we're one mile away let's go pick it up Ready to roll. Go grab it. They said we gotta keep moving, guys. We ain't stopping today. Thirty-six thousand. That'd be sweet. Turn left. See you later. It's a really good horse racing game. You can do any horse race around the world, I believe, except for Kentucky Derby. Well, that's interesting. I mean, I love horse racing. Right? I grew up basically at the track. Uh, my family had a, a racehorse. So, um, I love that. I love horse betting. So, I will definitely check it out. Far lap. P-H-A-R lap. I'll have to check to see if it's on PC. Guys, we're doing a 36,000 euro job right now. Turn I'm excited. Left. It's far though, guys. It's probably 500 miles. It's going to be a long one. Different is better sometimes though when you have to pick up stuff. It's not just shut. Yeah. Yeah, I like normally you fast travel to the city of where the job is, and then you have to drive to where the actual trailer is. You'll pick up the trailer, then you'll do the job. But the jobs expire. So if you don't get there in time, like earlier in the stream, we missed one. It was twenty six thousand or something, and I didn't get there in time. And the job expired. But this one's right here, and it's thirty six thousand. So I am not missing this one. We are finished. Beep. All right. Let's see. Freight market. 36,000. Look how far this is. We're going from Germany all the way into all the way into France. All right, where's my trailer back there? Let's go. Let's go. All right. Let's go pick this thing up. Can you pick up some of the logs, though? Can we, can we pick up some of the stuff? I don't want to be driving over it with my truck. Right, let's make a little UV turn here. And we'll back this baby up.
There it is. Get that coupling done. Five hundred and five miles. Woo. Oh my gosh! All right. Well, listen, thirty-six thousand, right? We. It's gonna take me twelve hours and forty-two minutes. Twelve hours and forty-two minutes. All right, guys, better buckle up and get ready. It's gonna be a long one. Let's see how long this actually takes in, you know, JPace time, right? Because we're looking at it's eleven thirteen by me right now. Let's see how long it actually takes for five hundred and five miles. Someone remind me to check at the end. Well, let's just say we'll just say eleven fifteen. Make it easier to remember. Eleven fifteen. We started this job. Uh, it's only available on Switch, PS4, Xbox, and that's oh man, that stinks. Probably have to stop for fuel. I can imagine. There's no way we're driving 503 miles on a half a tank. Again, I'm hoping most of these miles are highway miles. Turn right. But we will have to see. I also have a much longer trailer than normal, so we got to be careful of our turns. Well, no problem getting up the hill. That's good. All right, here we go. Looks like we're making another little highway entrance here. Stay right. Stay right. Don't forget, we're going from Germany all the way into, like, center of France. Right. Let's see how many detours or accents we see on the way this time. Oh, uh, just we're just top five you're watching now for. Oh, jeez. Um, like it says, I think, I think Reddick, Gibbs, we're going straight. Um, Reddick, Gibbs, probably Byron, Larson, maybe, uh, maybe Elliot. I don't know. I mean, I have to, th I have to think towards the road racers, right? So Gibbs, Reddick, Elliot. I mean, Larson isn't really a road racer. He's just good anywhere. So what we'll the, I mean, and Byron, I think Byron has the pole, doesn't he? So we'll have to see, uh, we'll have to see how the race plays out. But again, you got stages. You know, the cautions are minimal, obviously, because the length of the track. I think the first gas station I see, guys, I'm going to stop because I'm not going to mess around. I'm not going to take a chance. Because I'm, I'm down to half a tank right now. Stay left, then turn left. Stay left, turn left. Oh, I'm not on a highway highway? We got, can, can we get me on like an actual highway so I can start knocking out these miles? Dad, this is a big trail. Yeah. This is my trailer right now. Hold on. Well, let's wait till we get on the highway. Then I'll give a better view of it. I think it's, it is longer than the actual tankers that we've been hauling. Uh oh, here's a hill. Here's our first test. Can the truck handle it? 
Reddick, Larson, Gibbs, Byron, AJ, and uh, are tied for the top five spots. Okay. Oh, AJ's racing this? Uh, if AJ's racing it, then, I mean, he's like, he has the most road wins of any racer in, in the, any career. All right, we made it up the hill. Get ready to turn right. Where's the highway, though? Is this the highway? Somewhat of a highway? Turn right. Oh, now it's going to rain and nighttime? Oh, we're in for some trouble here, guys. Raining and the nighttime. Don't worry, I got my wiper button. We're good. We got the window wipers. And we got lights. There's our lights. Perfect. Buttons work. I'm happy. All right. 448 miles left in the rain. Looks like pretty bad rain, too. He's working 12, AJ's 14th. Okay. Come on, man. I put my blinker on. You're not going to let me go? <coughs> Now listen, we gotta be careful here. All right, I don't wanna slide. I don't wanna damage the truck. It's raining out, it's wet. Let's play it smart. Let's see if we could do a little trailer view real quick. That's right. Uh, all right, so here we go trailer view. This is what we're cruising with a couple dual tractors some farm equipment And yeah, I think it I think it's longer than the regular tanker that we are hauling But yep, that's what we got Well, let's focus on driving. I don't like skin. I don't want to go too fast. I don't want to slide Looks like we got some uh oh the last thing i want to do is take damage right i don't want to use up the money i just made to pay off damage to the truck so let's dry off the roads it does look a little longer unless it's just me but probably know it's the same exact size and i'm just a i'm just a dummy Whatever you do, don't hit your brake pedal while you're turning. Just, was this fuel? Yeah, let's get some gas here real quick. Okay, let's find a new route. Oh. Alright, who's gonna go first? I'm so impatient. I'm like, let's go. Fuel your truck up and get out of there. At the end of the day, there's only one driver that will beat your favorite driver. That's right. Denny Hamlin. Finally, man. Jeez. Take forever. Fuel it up. How many gallons are we going to take here? Let's see. Eighty-five gallons. All right, let's get out of here. That guy's still waiting. What is he fueling up? Nine trucks. All right, so we have fuel. We're good to go till we get there. Let's get back out on the highway. Doing some nighttime driving. I think this is the first nighttime drive we did today. And of course, it just happens to be raining. Stay right. 
is it only rain game or maybe tornadoes i forget how like how severe the weather can get in this i don't think there's any snow i think it's only rain exit left oh 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 Oh, man, I gotta do something about that change camera button. I don't like it. I don't like it. Because when I switch to, like, the side view to see, I always miss the button to, to change it back. All right, going up another hill here. I'm in ninth gear, though. Ooh. I'm carrying a little bit of speed. 26, 25, 24, 20... Ah, we made it. Okay, we're good. Is my camera twitching out? Storm chaser simulator. That'd be cool, right? Just drive into a tornado. The bridge or railroad crossing? A railroad. Slow down. I remember I hit one of those little crossings there at like almost full speed and I just destroyed my trailer. <laughs> I didn't realize it was a railroad crossing. I just went. Whoa, take it easy there, bus. Why? We're gonna do what? 385 miles on back roads here. Can we do some? Is it possible to do some uh, some highways? Maybe. Let's turn the wipers off. Go. No. Easy mode simulator. <laughs> Dolphin Master is here. What's going on, Dolphin Master? How are you? Nope. How's your day going? How's your weekend going? Slam on that like button, Dolphin. I appreciate it if you do. the rain that's good two lane highways yeah this is this is not where i want to be traveling i want like an actual highway but it looks like we'll be on this for a bit so whatever it is what it is we just gotta take our time because we don't want to go too fast uh noah just brought in 1500 uh noah's also leveled up so that's good No, it just basically paid for my fuel. That's that's what just happened there. Another railroad crossing? Oh no, okay. I got nervous. I was like, slam on the brakes. Got some more fuel here we could have hit. 200 meters. And fifty whoa, three hundred and fifty miles to go. Whatever I I will probably level up from this also. I imagine I'll probably get to level fifteen. But I think we were almost halfway there. Uh no camera, I just filled up. I filled up right before I got on this road. I guess maybe you stepped away, but yeah, we just filled up the fuel. We're good. I don't think I'll have to fill up again. It doesn't tell me this truck doesn't tell me how many miles till empty like other trucks do i think the volvos do i forget but this one does not but i don't think i'll have to fill up again i'm just trying to take it slow jeez sorry Took that turn a little too wide 
finally seen some other traffic though. Drop it down a gear here. We're sitting way too low in RPM. Stay left and then turn left. Stay left, turn left. Got it. Thank you. Rolling backwards, guys. Rolling backwards. How much you stand to make this time let's say let's take a look at our stats here so we're we're hauling 11 tons worth of tractors um 36 000 euros we're supposed to make as long as we get there on time with no with no incidents so this will be my largest haul i've ever done in euro truck simulator uh value wise so 36 thousand Stay right, then turn right. Turn right. I don't think we're going to have a lot of caution since NASCAR was scared to keep the same restart. Yeah, no. I think we see one caution and then the stage breaks. That's what I'm expecting. I think it's going to be a very low caution race. straight no one acknowledged my red light i just ran please thank you let's not make a thing of it i ran a red light i was trying to figure out my button because for some reason it was not switching to seventh gear i ran a red light it's fine we all do it take the first exit we all do it at least once in 12th gear what is going on here stay left and then continue straight can we get on a damn highway can we please i'm not doing 300 miles of this back road left turn right turn stoplight stuff get me on a highway please I want to hit the open road and I want to knock out 200 miles on the highway. What are we doing here? Now I'm going to struggle up this hill in seventh gear. It just passed midnight. We still have seven hours to go. So we will be arriving in daytime, which is cool. I do for lunch when i'm done streaming what should i eat a little jersey mike's uh -huh, a little jersey mike's cheesesteak maybe i'm thinking that's what i'm thinking no time for sleep just drive i know right not sleeping there is a camera there is a like fatigue mode that you can turn on in the game and the game will literally tell you like you have to stop and then you'll sleep 
but it's just weird because you, there's no option to pick how many hours you want to sleep for it just it does six hours so there's a good chance that if you sleep you're gonna miss the window of delivery and then you get penalized so it's like uh like why am i gonna why would i turn that on like i get the realism of it like yeah no guy is really driving for 20 hours straight right it's not possible um like you have to rest but when you do that then the game's like yeah we're gonna rest you for a mandatory six hours and then you're gonna miss your delivery sushi sushi no sushi for me what's up kb how you doing you hanging out you still watching you chilling TikTok, hit the follow button. TikTok, hit the like button. Tap the screen. Let's go. YouTube, if you have not hit the like button on this video, I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing right now, but you need to figure your life out if you haven't hit the like button on these streams. Thank you. Oh, man, guys, 277 miles to go. We're almost at the halfway point. I can't believe we're doing a 505 mile job. But it's for 36,000 euros, which is amazing. That's a massive chunk of our loan that we can uh, throw in our bank account. And we're getting a little bit of trickles. We're getting those little trickles from our other drivers. I mean, I can't wait till I have five drivers and I got $200 each coming in from all of them. Man, we're going to be rich. So rich from all their income. I just don't understand why they don't make more money. Like, why are we still like their max level? They're 5.0, right? Their rating is 5.0. They're they're leveling up as they go, but they're still bringing in jobs for like 500 euros. Like, that doesn't do anything. Obviously, that's after their expenses and after their fuel and after everything. That's how much I make from their job. So I guess in theory, sure, I'm still making money. But if the guy's doing like a 13 hour job, and my profit is 500 euros. It's like, what are we doing here? Because in 13 hours, I'm doing this job. I'm making 36,000, right? So to have that driver making 500 in the same amount of time, yeah, it just, I don't know. It doesn't make sense. I mean, maybe as they actually level up and they get those little, you know, bonuses for doing long distance and high, high value cargo, maybe then the money will start going up but i mean it's it's annoying to just look down and go hey noah did a job 350 bucks in your pocket but that doesn't do anything for me i need thousands okay we have 314,000 euros that we need to pay off right we gotta pay it off and 500 euros at a time is gonna take 17 years that's that's my calculation i just did that in my head real quick about 17 years if we're making 500 uh every day someone can do the actual math and let me know if i'm right or not but <coughs> all right we are officially halfway 234 miles to go five hours 49 minutes we're on somewhat of a highway that is literally just like a switchback back and forth just give me a straight run oh we have a toll plaza now we got a toll plaza to deal with um we're going here we're just gonna go here and figure it out all right let's throw some numbers down how much do you think this toll is gonna be all right, this is the start of the toll road. I say the toll is going to be 110. 110 euros for the toll. It's 2 a.m. So the sun uh, should be starting to come up in a few hours. A couple hours. Whoa. Look at these signs in the road. Oh, there's construction here. Sorry, I can't stop. I have a big truck. You gotta wait for me. Oh, 
110 seems steep for a toll. Okay, well, we'll see. We're going to find out shortly when we get off this highway. We'll see what the toll comes to be. I mean, normally they're like 30 bucks or 30 euros, 60 euros. But I... Oh. Come on, car, move. This GPS is horrible, okay? You tell me last minute. Am I really getting off here? Is this where the toll plaza is going to be? Because that's going to be a very, very inexpensive toll. Turn left. I'm just happy I don't have to back this trailer up at nighttime. Just Nova, what's going on? Oh, on TikTok too. What's going on, Nova? How are you? I'm surprised you didn't jump to YouTube. But it's okay. Welcome. Glad that you made it. Glad that you decided to uh, brave the day and wake up. Cameron's over here on YouTube chatting it up. Um, let's go here. Let's see, Cameron. It's going to be cheap. It's going to be like 20. 17, guys. 17 euros. That's not bad. I didn't think it was going to be the first exit. So I kind of was like thrown off. Because I'm like, I got 204 miles to go. Potentially, this could be an expensive toll. Right. But uh, it was not. So... I just want the sun to start peeking out, right? I just want that little bit of break of daylight. I just don't like driving nighttime in this. I don't know why. Not bad, 10 times less. <laughs> yeah, basically. 196 miles, guys. We are, man, turn left. Turn left. Gotcha. Still windy out? Jeez. I feel like I live in Chicago. Oh, here we go. Income. Yes. Thank you, Noah. Thank you for your 310 euros. Man, I could buy a, a chicken sandwich now with your money. I'm so happy that I hired you. What are we doing? Why are we making 310? I would love to see what job he did. I want to see what job he did because 310 euros is literally a waste of my time i'm paying that guy 90 percent of the money i make i don't get it Three hundred and ten. you gotta be kidding me like just keep it dude just keep it just, just take it all like it literally does nothing for me to give me 310 euros Again, I understand that's after fuel, that's after maintenance, that's after his pay. Like, I understand. It's still profit, sure. But, like, if the guy's doing a seven hour job, eight hour job, whatever it is, and in the end, I'm making 300, it just doesn't seem like you move someone from one house to another. I mean, literally, what are you doing for 310? It just, it's frustrating. Cause then like the next job he'll do like 1400. Like I need them to bring in like 6,000, right? I need them to be doing these $36,000 jobs. And there's no, that's the thing. There's no way to change it. Like they just do what they do, right? And also 
Sub Nova. Um, and also, like if they take, let's just say they go from A to B, right? And there's no job at B, they just drive back to A empty. And you'll see it, like it'll just be negative money. Like they just drove back empty because they couldn't find a job. I'm like, what? Well, what do we? I feel like that that um, logistic side of the game probably could use an update. Like if I'm driving something somewhere, I'm making sure I got something coming back. But this game's like, I don't know. We'll just send you back to your garage empty and charge your your owner maintenance and fuel. This is my first time watching a live on YouTube. I mean, what better way to do it than to watch J-Pace, right? I mean, that's, I, I can't think of a better way to, to watch your first live on YouTube and it's me. Come on, it's great. Make sure you hit that uh, subscribe button and the like button. Hit the like, Nova, hit the like, hit the little thumbs up. Um, yeah, but we're just, uh, we're having some fun here. We're, uh, almost two hours into the stream, doing some deliveries, having fun. First time using the new wheel and stuff for Euro Truck Simulator. It's going pretty well. <coughs> I'm getting hungry, so we'll see how many more I do after this one. But we still have 141 miles of this. But the sun is peeking out, guys. It is getting brighter out, which I'm so excited. I love the detailing of the, the environments and the places you drive through. Right? I just do. I like it. So I like daytime. Nighttime's like interesting. You know, you get your lights. I can pop on my head, my uh, high beams. But what are we stopping for here? It's four o'clock in the morning and I'm driving through a neighborhood. There's only one thing that anyone should do if you're in this situation, okay? If you're driving through a nice, quaint little neighborhood and it's four o'clock in the morning. You just gotta make sure you wake them up. So, that's all. I'm just kidding. Don't do that. That's mean. What's up, Rays? How are you? afternoon to you as well you just you gotta wake them up right it's it's four o'clock it's like farmland out here they probably got chickens they gotta take care of right so just give them a little just wake them up right get up what are you doing the sun's shining look what do you got here sunflowers what is this uh, whatever it is you gotta pick it right you gotta get out there get out to the fields wake them up all right i'm done being mean I take, I take it all back. I take it all back. I, w I wouldn't do that. I really wouldn't. I would use my Jake brake and just slam on the engine braking and then just wake him up that way. I'm good, man. I'm good. If you're new to the channel, new to the stream, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the like button. I'd appreciate it. I do all types of racing content over here. Monster trucks. We do NASCAR. We do your truck simulator. We do some wreck fest once in a while. Uh, fuel guys, we're still good on fuel, surprisingly. We still have uh, almost a half a tank, a little more than half a tank of fuel, so we're not going to stop here. But look at the, just, I like the daytime. I'm traveling through the forest right now. I wound up in like <clears throat> maybe Brazil, the rainforest over here. What's going on with these trees? This one looks kind of odd. Oh, we're back into farmland now. Who's maintaining these trees? They look very... Uh-oh. Speed trap. Oh, my gosh. Turn right. Turn right. Any cars coming? No. 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 Okay, go. Are we close? No, we still have 110 miles. I feel like when you get off, Wreckfest is great. Wreckfest is amazing. Wreckfest is literally one of the best car games you can buy. Hands down. Whether it's the graphics, the physics, the drivability of the game. Like, literally, Wreckfest is the first game I tell people. Like, oh, I like cars. What game should I get? Get Wreckfest. It's amazing. It's so much fun. It's just the only bad thing is not a lot of people either know it 
or watch it. That's the problem. So it's not it's not good. Oh, it's not good to stream. Like I don't get a big following of people when I stream it. But playability wise, Breakfast is awesome. Guys, are we good with that? Am I getting the little Jersey Mike's cheesesteak? Uh, it's modern day destruction derby. Yes, it is. Cam, if you find it in your store, man, uh, I'm telling you, get Wreckfest, dude. You'll have you will have a load of fun with it. Uh, this is so nice to watch. It's like ASMR for driving. It is right. Fantastic. I mean, you got you got the truck sounds. You got my sound i mean you, might as well just, you could fall asleep to this my son is also into anything with racing well cam what are we doing here man what are we doing we should be best friends no that's exactly why i said something satisfying it is satisfying right look at this look at the sun behind me look at that sun behind me Woo. look at the graphics i'm gonna hit something i better go back and oh oh geez Get back on the road. <laughs> See, I try to show you some nice scenery and I almost crash. But it's okay. We we recovered. We recovered. Don't say oof. Okay, don't say oof. Okay, we ran into the grass a little bit. We did a little damage to the grass. Look at negative $400 from Noah. Yes, negative 400. So the 310 he just made me did not even cover the negative 410 he just caused me. All right, this is ridiculous, this game. Maybe it's just, maybe I just don't have to, just don't get drivers. Just don't hire drivers. Maybe that's what this game's all about. It's Euro Truck Simulator Solo Edition. How do you lose? How do you make 310 and then literally the next job you lose 400 and something dollars? Like it just does it. I'm I'm boggles my mind right now. I can't. How many, how's my company supposed to grow? I have to have a conversation with Noah back at the shop. I got to pull him aside and be like, listen, man, you ain't going to be working here much longer if you're only bringing in 310 and then you literally give it back the next job gosh all right guys we got uh 65 miles left to go before we make this delivery and then we'll see maybe we'll do maybe we'll do one more after that which will put us about hopefully put us over a hundred thousand in the bank which would be fantastic time to let uh the help get to i know right sean I mean, Sean, you've been watching from the from the start, man. From the from the episode one of my Euro Truck journey here. Why are they not making more money? I mean, Raphael usually brings in a thousand, maybe fifteen hundred, right? But Noah, I don't want to fire the guy because I don't think I can hire somebody as skilled as him. Like I would have to start with a fresh guy. Wait for the interview. They're gonna want to raise. Yeah, I know, right? That's the thing. As they level up, they automatically take more money. But also, they should. I think honestly, I think the is, the issue is the limitation of their trucks. I don't think they can take all types of jobs, and that's limiting them to like basic jobs, and they can't make good money. I think that's the problem. So what? Well, I don't want to. Oh, man, I want to pay off this loan. I don't want to dump more money into their trucks. I don't know. We might have to look at their truck upgrades to see if maybe we could do something for them. Just gave you a follow on X. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. I don't go on uh, X much. I want to start using it again to post my videos, but I appreciate that. Look at this. Look at the scenery here. Isn't this just great? Just drive my old truck here. They have cinematics. Let's see. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, I'm gonna crash. I gotta stop. <laughs> he should be making more than three times, right? All right, we'll, we'll have to look at his job, see what he's really doing. Look at this guy, pulls out right in front of everybody. Go straight. What are we doing here? We don't have the stop sign. Gosh. You can tell my aggressive behavior is because I live in a state that we're aggressive. All right, 26 miles, guys. We're almost done with this 505 mile delivery. Probably one of my longest and definitely my most profitable. 36 thousand euros going into the bank at the end of this one very excited excited to bulk up that uh the bank account just to spend it on truck upgrades for my failing business partners they're ready to turn left got it thank you I don't know why you're whispering to me. Like you're whispering in my ear. Turn left. I should put ASMR in my titles. I wonder if it would help with the hits. All right, Burgess's new place discovered. And what's this, a dealership? Oh, Renault dealership found, okay. Can we put my map back up, please? Thank you. Go straight. A nice little town. I mean, it's 7 a.m. They definitely should be up by now. Like, I'm not even messing around. If you're not up by 7 a.m., what are we doing? What are we doing? Six miles left to go. Looks like we have a little bit of a roundabout here. Go straight. Go straight. Oh! At the roundabout, take the second exit. Exit now! Exit now. I don't think I said that today. It's like my go-to line. Get ready to turn right. All right. Turn right. We're going straight out. Oh, directly straight. Perfect. Can you give me a 90 XP? I feel like we haven't had any 90 XPs. They've been all 40s. It's all over now. We made it, guys. We made a C40 XP again. Where are we going? All right here? Okay. Back up a little bit, though. Weird that this place needs tractors. Okay, we'll deliver them. We're gonna try to deliver them. Let's see. I lined that up pretty good, actually. And there it is. Wow, that was real quick. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. 502 miles, 12 hours and four minutes, 105 gallons of fuel, 36,000, 1,292 experience, guys. We leveled up to level 15. Nice. Let's see, current job offers from this one. Oh, we leveled up. Let's see. Let's go with, let's stick with long distance. We've been doing long distance anyway. The delivery's up to... 
delivers up to 683 miles is a 20 percent higher reward for deliveries longer than 528 okay all right and their current job oh they have a job oh my gosh 29,000 32,000 21,000 9 000. okay before we pick another job here how much did you make i made 36 36 we got 85 in the bank let's take a look at our drivers real quick here so Raphael is he's going to be done with something in one hour and Noah let's look at your log Noah so you you drove oh wait you actually made a delivery it wasn't even it wasn't like an empty trailer you went from Luxembourg to Reims 77 miles and you lost money Come on, guys. Empty pallets, 310. 100, you drove 134 miles to make 310. You got to be kidding me. But yeah, look at the job above. He drove two more miles, 136 miles, and he made 1,500. And right now he's on a 11-hour haul from Reims to Luxembourg. I don't know. Oh, Noah. I don't know what we're going to do with you. And Raphael, he's been my boss since the beginning, man. This guy's my first driver. He makes like 2,300, 1,400. I mean, he makes some decent jobs. He had this one. He came back empty from Dijon. Is there a way to moderate uh, then like fix their job? No, there's literally nothing. All you do is hire them and they just take jobs based on what their training is. But again, they have all the ADRs. So they could do explosives and things like that and fuel. But they don't really have a lot of the other stuff. So they're not getting bonuses for long distance or high value or um, urgent jobs, things like that. So as they level up, they'll start filling up these boxes and then they'll make more money. I just have to be patient. I mean, they're bringing in about 3,100 a day and 2,800 a day. So as long as they're covering the loan, which if we look, uh, the loan is 5,700 a day. So we gotta, you know, that's all I really care about. We're at we're at 80. How much do we have? We have 85,000 in the bank. Let's go to job market here. See if we could do one more. Most expensive one was 31. No. Most expensive one was 39. Expires in five hours. 36. There's some more tractors. Oh, this is like a. Uh, that's a double style. Um, let's see. 31, 31, 31, 31, 29. Cool looking trailer, roof lights. What is in France here? France has this one, 32,000. It's a standard delivery of ADR class two. This one's 29. This one's gonna take a ferry. It's 65. It's Better for the money because it's 65 a mile. You're making more money per mile. Not much, but um, 51, 39. Let's see price per distance. So the best one is this one, 65. Do we want to go up to make our last job up to UK? Take a ferry? We haven't taken a ferry today. So I guess we could do that. It's some more tractors though. Probably the tractors I just dropped off. Um, or do we want to do up to the Netherlands? I feel like I want to take the, it's only a couple thousand less. I feel like I want to take the ferry. Ferry distance, 37 miles. Ferry price, 300. Total trip times, 10 hours, 439 miles on land. Also, we started, wait, did we start that job at 1115? That one job took 45 minutes. Is that right? Didn't we say 1115? All right, we'll do this one. Time to hit the road. We're going to do this one. I don't know if it's... Oh, it's at this... It's at the place I'm at already. Okay. So we're going to go here. Great market. Pick up this one. 29,000. Trailer's ready. I think it's at the end, right? Yeah, okay. Time to get the job done. We'll back up and we'll go grab this trailer. That 
let's do this. All right, final job of the stream here, guys. 476 miles. Man, we did like, I think we did close to 2,000 miles today. But this one has a ferry, so I'm liking that. I mean, it's a quick ferry ride. It's only 36 miles on the ferry, but we still haven't done it. So uh, we'll grab some fuel probably in town here. If we can, or we can grab it on the way. Turn left. A little monster is awake. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Killer Cam's attention is gone. He's no longer paying attention to J-Pace. Exit down. Alright, we're going to Paris. Towards Paris. Alright, little toll plaza here. I think we could go this one. I'll have to stop. There we go. What up, Jay? How are you, man? What's going on, JJ Holiday? How's your day going? How's your weekend going? We're uh, we're starting our last haul here before I go and get some lunch. Merge in here. Thank you. Oh, wrong gear. Wrong gear. He woke up wanting food. Of course he did. Of course he did. All right, let's let's take a guess here. Okay, we got nine hours. How much do we think Raphael is going to make from that job that expires in an hour? I'm going to say it's going to be a thousand. I hope it's a thousand. What are you making for food? That's what I want to know. Some French toast sticks, maybe some waffles, bagels, some eggs. Oh, no, jeez. <laughs> I went to use my blinker. Oh, there's a gas station there. Whoops. Um, I went to use my blinker and I definitely hit the wrong button. Sorry, uh, not being as active in chat, but I'm hanging out watching. No problem. That's fine. All good, Nova. Just your presence here makes everyone happier. Chilling, sir. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. Just, you know, playing some Euro Truck Simulator. Obviously, we've got the NASCAR race coming up at 3.30. So I'm excited about that. I'm going to go get some uh, good cheesesteak after I finish streaming. So I'm excited about that. My son wants eggs. Nice. Okay. Okay. That's good. A little protein. Nothing wrong with that. I feel like I need to have like the stream chat, like the chats on my screen somewhere so that TikTok can see YouTube and YouTube can see TikTok. I just don't. What are we stopping for? I was gonna get in back of you. Come on. Um, I just don't want my screen filled up with chats, you know, but I guess I got to figure that out somehow. I just don't know how I could easily do it without it being stupid. You know, because I know that when I'm responding to people on TikTok, YouTube's like, what? And when I respond to people on YouTube, TikTok's like, I don't know what you're saying, dude, but okay. So I got to, I got to figure that out. 
<laughs> Why are you stopping? I love my horn button, guys. I'm just letting you know. I love my new horn button. <laughs> hey, you found the gas pedal. Thank you. You're awesome. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Oh, geez, you really found the gas pedal. You're doing like a buck 90. Trial and error. Yeah, I know. I, I got a lot going on on my stream PC it is, as it is. But I think I could probably share screen um, in OBS to show that. That's another thing. Like OBS. I don't know. I mean, showing TikTok on YouTube won't be hard. Showing YouTube on TikTok, I think, is going to be the issue. So, we'll have to see. But I want to do something. I want to get those those chats. Like, I want the people to see the other chat so they know what's going on. So, I'll have to look up some options. Look up some features that I can use. Uh, just do it the crazy taxi way. I hit... Don't hit... No, I don't want to hit anybody. Camera, you need to understand that when you like you can just tap a guardrail in this and it's like two percent damage and it's like oh that's gonna cost me nine grand so like you gotta be very careful not to hit anything or your your savings account starts to dwindle but listen guys we're down to 382 miles of this final journey it's been a fantastic sunday morning just cruising don't forget guys tomorrow night nascar 5 p.m eastern standard time we'll be doing nascar i don't know what track i'm doing yet because obviously today is coda normally we do the track from sunday on monday nascar heat 5 doesn't have coda nor do i like to do road races so i think we said we're gonna do texas again but uh I don't know, we'll, we'll see what we wind up with the driver I choose, obviously, if you don't know, is the loser of the race. So whoever comes in dead last on Sunday is my driver on Monday. But uh, if you don't follow the channel, make sure you follow along if you want to see some NASCAR content. Again, we use our sim rig. We throw down a nice 50% race and uh, we have some fun with it. <coughs> Do, 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 do. Stay, right. Stay right. Got it. Thank you. Oh, we need we need fuel, guys. We need fuel big time. And I oh, here's the toll plaza. Is there fuel coming up anywhere? Ugh. Uh, let's see how much the toll is going to be. I'm saying 42. 42. 80? 80? That's like highway robbery. Eighty euros? Are you kidding me? You're firstborn. Like seriously, eighty? How was it seventeen the one time? This was eighty. I didn't go that much further, did I? I right, serious though, guys. We, we're gonna run out of fuel. We're gonna run out of fuel, and I don't want to have to call a tow truck to bring me fuel. But I have a feeling that we're gonna run out of fuel because I don't see. I don't see any gas stations coming up. We didn't, we didn't get the warning light yet, right? But it's coming. And I don't want to have to get off this highway to get fuel. That's a lot more steep, right? Yeah, it was. We might have to get off the highway. Just to be honest, we, we might have to. 
Whoa! Come on, man. I'm driving a massive truck with a huge trailer. You're gonna cut me off with your little Mini Cooper? <coughs> can't, can't, I can't deal with these people. 320 miles to go. We need fuel. I see no gas stations. We got people cutting us off. We got crazy toll prices. This is the, yeah, that get, yeah, thank you. Oh man, I just, I just, I gotta make myself laugh guys. I'm literally driving 2000 miles today. All I can do is make myself laugh. <coughs> oh, but seriously though, where am I getting fuel? Three hundred and six miles to go. I don't see any fuel stations. Stay right and exit right. Exit right. Wonder what happens if you try to go through those bat like the those arrows it's like no you can't go this way what happens if you try to go Does just smash your vehicle oh and now we're gonna go on the back roads oh we're definitely not gonna find fuel i mean there's a rest stop over there but there's no fuel right what is this place Oh, that's on the other highway. Never mind. We're almost a little one bar left on our our gas gauge here. How close to empty? Very close, dude. I mean, like close, close. I'm hoping that there's some fuel in this town. Hoping, but I don't see anything on the map. Loan installment just got Paris discovered. Okay. Loan installment just came out. 5,700 taken. That's fine. We got the money. I'm expecting that. Uh, I think we have something coming up here. Maybe. I mean, there's a lot of stuff going on here. It seems like it's a pretty busy town. I mean, it's Paris, right? So hopefully there's a fuel station here because my light is about to come on. Oh, I see gas. Yes. Yes. Thank you. I see a gas station. We are saved. Because if you run out of fuel, then you have to call a tow truck and they charge you a crazy amount of money to come bring you fuel Exit or tow or tow you to a near gas station so i didn't want to have to do that i just wonder if the warning light's gonna come on before we get there because it is close no all right here's the fuel station we made it We made it. We're good. We're good. We are good. All right. Let's fuel up. This little button I use is very temperamental because it's like a little mini joystick. So it wants to go up, down, left, right. Not stay center. Thousand nine hundred euros for 126 gallons of fuel. I like that it says gallons. Like everything's euro, but then it says gallons. That doesn't make sense. Shouldn't it be liters. All 
All right, let's get back out on the road. Finish up this journey. 278 miles to go. Full tank of fuel. Uh, usually it's between seven and nine hundred, seven and like a thousand euros, depending on how low you are. Like that was nine hundred. That was almost on empty. So I'd imagine if this thing was completely bone dry, it would probably be a thousand. But I mean, the prices do fluctuate fluctuate on where you are. So sometimes you'll get a half a tank for seven hundred. Oh, my stomach is like, give me food. Get me back out on the highway, knock down some miles, get some paychecks. How has Raphael not finished that job? It was only an hour. Right? Didn't say he had an hour left. <coughs> if you guys are just coming in on YouTube, make sure you slam that like button, hit the subscribe button for the channel also. And if you want to become a monthly member, I would appreciate it. Support the channel even more. You can hit that join button and join the J Pace Racing Club and join the other fantastic members I have as we travel through this journey of racing and vehicle content. TikTok, love you guys as well. Make sure you hit those like, tap the screen. Get this out to more people. Share it. Did you crash? No, I did not crash. I've not crashed, Sean. Okay. Not a single accident today. No damage to any of my trailers or my cab. It's been a very successful day. I got a flat tire? What do you mean? What's going on? Why do you think... What's going on? What am I missing here? Oh, Rafa... Oh... I'm like, wait, I'm like, what happened? I don't, I don't think I have a flat tire. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It, I mean, it said one hour remaining, but I haven't seen any money click away. So we'll have to see. <laughs> All right, another toll road. Let's throw our guesses out. Let's see, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say another 80. So I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say another 80, 80 euros on the toll plaza today. I feel like we're on the highway for a while this time, going to my map. We have a long trek ahead of us here. But at least it'll chew up a lot of the miles, which I'm happy about. I said it's easy to knock out these miles when you're on the highway, especially when you're doing 60, 65. I mean, I don't think we missed the Sean thing, right? Don't forget, guys, we still have a ferry ride. So this 233 miles gets us to the ferry, right? And then we take 36-mile ferry. And I think we have a little bit of uh, land after the ferry. So I like about this game because you actually drive onto the ferry, the ferry boat, which is cool. Stay left. Oh, I'm staying left, buddy. Still looking for some gloves, guys. Still need to find some, some racing gloves so I don't destroy my new wheel. I feel like I need to get some FedEx racing gloves. 
I mean, it technically would be fitting, right? Obviously, Denny Hamlin, FedEx. So when I do NASCAR, it makes sense. And then I'm Euro Truck Simulator. I'm doing deliveries, right? Like FedEx. So I think that would be my best bet. Find me some FedEx racing gloves. some fishing off the ferry right that'd be cool <sighs> and just like that we are under 200 miles to go Still plenty of highway left. I don't think I've ever taken this ferry from up here, right? Or did we? Oh, here's a toll plaza. What's it gonna be? 42. 44 man i almost nailed it i almost nailed it i said 42 and it was 44. i mean we went about 60 miles right because we were at 234 and we went down to 175. <sighs> Oh, yeah, 50 uh 50 something miles oh i see no that's not the ferry is it oh it's like a bus terminal oh it's a, oh that's the train terminal oh okay that's that yeah so there's another thing you could do. You could drive your truck onto a train, which we have not done yet. And that's over to the right. There's a train terminal. Oh, gee, what's going on, man? How are you? Well, maybe we are taking a... Uh... Yeah, I thought this was supposed to be a... No, it said ferry, didn't it? Why does it show a picture of a train? Oh, well, well, we'll see, guys. I thought it was a ferry. I could have swore it was a ferry. Where are we going here? Yeah, this looks like uh, the train depot. Why did I think there was a ferry? Am I taking a train to the ferry? Also, which way am I going? Going down this one? I don't want to go down the wrong one. Yeah, okay. All right, well, we're going to get on a train, guys. Just crawled out of bed. Nice. I I could have swore it said ferry, but we're going to put our truck onto a train. Possible destinations. Let's see. Oh, okay. So it's uh, yeah. See, it's like 
I guess, okay. 35 minutes, 300 euros, guys, to take this thing. Recomputing. Never mind. Oh my gosh. I'll find a new route. Okay, train station. There we go. All right, now we can get out of this thing. Without crashing. All right, 116 miles left to go. All right, so we did the train. I thought it said ferry. I don't know why. I could be losing my mind, though. But at the top, when I was reading the distances, I thought it said ferry distance, 36 miles, not train distance. Whatever, we're here. 116 miles left to go. That was fun. I keep forgetting you have to drive on the other side of the road now. I forgot. All right. Let's knock out this last 113 miles, get our paycheck. We'll check on some stats again with our other drivers, see what the heck happened to Raphael. Well, that's what I said. Maybe we just missed the notification. Maybe that's what it was. But I didn't see it pop up. I saw the loan installment pop up, right? During this drive. I saw the loan installment pop up, and that was it. Right? Because the two Noah things were from the last delivery. Oh, sunflowers look how beautiful it looks guys it's just so beautiful uh i'm euro truck delirious right now i think oh no come on don't finish it up with rain you know we were going so good now we got uh they put our windshield wipers back on you now why couldn't we do this one nice sunny day I mean, we still have 102 miles, so maybe where we're making the delivery, it won't be raining. Noah hasn't done anything this drive, but Raphael, I mean, it, again, it said one hour, so he should have been done, but he didn't post any earnings. So once we, once we get to the uh, this destination, we'll, a little car accident, oof. Um, oh, that's cool little farming farming equipment going on over there uh yeah once we get to this destination 93 miles away then we'll check on the drivers again and kind of see where we're at but we should have got money from him after the stream guys i'm gonna go get some food i'm gonna do some homework and then by then the uh the NASCAR race should be coming on. I'll crash on my couch and relax a little bit. Should be a pretty, pretty good Sunday.
I did not realize that that turn was that sharp and it is raining out and I almost almost ruined my perfect day we almost ruined it but I, I pumped the brakes I'm excited to see some NASCAR yeah NASCAR will be tomorrow night Nova if you're around for it 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time we'll be doing some NASCAR hopefully it's uh it's always a fun time I mean TikTok shows up hopefully YouTube shows up it's uh it's obviously more fast paced i'm i do my best to keep up with chat but obviously you're constantly you're constantly driving the whole race so yeah it's uh it's always a good time but guys we almost destroyed our truck there like we almost ruined our flow and that would not have been good our money could have been gone this guy needs to move yeah i'll be there here there here will be there by coming here i'll be there yeah sure i know you'll be there i i sh probably shouldn't have done texas with the trucks yesterday um knowing that i was most likely going to be doing texas tomorrow because we don't have coda but it's fine i mean i love texas i'll drive texas all the time <clears throat> so we'll see unless i change my mind OG, I will say one of the, my main comments on TikTok is how the hell are you racing and keeping up with chat? But I do it. I do a very good job at it because I want people to be engaged and I want them to feel like they're part of something. But yeah, I mean, when I'm in NASCAR, it's uh, it's more challenging than Euro Truck Simulator, obviously. But yeah, we uh, we keep up with chat. We do good. 51 miles to go, guys. The rain is coming down even faster. Crank these windshield wipers up. But uh, yeah, NASCAR is always a fun time. I just got to figure out what track. I mean, I guess I, I have to do Texas. I mean, Coda is in Texas, and that's my only option. Okay, let's slow down here, J Pace. Peace. We don't want to crash with 44 miles to go. Oh my gosh i don't trust the tires that's it i don't trust the tires i don't want to turn the wheel too much right i don't want to slide i'm just trying to go as slow as i can but as fast as i can you get it there's that little tiny middle area where i'm trying to hit i don't want to slide off the road but i also don't want to you know do two miles an hour but we got a little bit of a straightaway here. We can crank up the speed. But we do have a pretty sharp turn coming up, so we'll make sure we break ahead of time. 31 miles to go of our final job of the day. Almost a two well, over a two and a half hour stream today. I just was feeling it. Right, normally I'm doing like an hour and a half. But today I was like, you know what? Let's stay on. Let's make some money. I, I think it was I got very excited at the fact that um i saw like twenty eight thousand dollar jobs that's i mean that was motivation in itself grand tourism was a little more focused man because of so many uh turns i guess or i'm not just good enough yet but i'll get there. no that's like when i do uh, a set of corsa right a set of courses uh you know your gt racing on actual courses right and you're turning left turning right whatever it's not just an oval um and yeah when i play games like that like there's no i, I can't chat much if, then again, I don't really race those games much. But, uh, yeah, Tuesday, if we stream Tuesday, we're going to be doing the new Monster Truck Championship game. So if you're into Monster Trucks or anything like that, I'll be doing that game on Tuesday, most likely. Um, but, yeah, tomorrow's NASCAR. The sun is coming out, guys. Let's turn off these wipers. Coming close to our final destination here. Actually, we need a little bit of wiper on. But I try to do a variety of content for my racing channel. Not everyone likes NASCAR. Not everyone likes monster trucks. Not everyone likes Euro Truck Simulator. Um, but I try to mix it up. Stay right, then turn right. 
always be willing to crash for chat. Oh, I mean, yeah, of course, right? I try not to, though. Right. You know, I try not to crash because I try to take the games I play seriously. I mean, there are people out there that put out content where they're just, you know, they'll go backwards on the track and just not my thing. Eight miles to go. Eight miles to go. Like I said, I think we've drove uh, over 2,000 miles today, right? We did a 500, another close to 500, a 390, and then one more. So maybe 1,500 miles? Not bad. Maybe this one will give me a 90 XP, though. I don't know why none of them were giving me 90 XPs. They're all 40. Turn left. I want that extra experience. Southampton. Okay. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Uh, I'm the same way. I'm very competitive. Yeah, I mean, like, if I'm going to play a game, I'm going to play the game, right? I'm not, I'm going to take it seriously. Uh, drinking and chat, different games, different challenges, kind of like... This is where it is. Yes, yeah, I know. All right, here we go. It basically looks exactly like the place I picked it up from. Or no, that was that other job, right? All right. Oh, come on. Where's the 90 XPs? Where we got to drop this thing off? Right here? Right? Yeah, okay. So we'll go... We'll go this way. We'll go this way and back it up. I don't think I showed you guys the trailer. This is what we just hauled. Again, it's just two tractors. Uh, no extra farm equipment, but you could see back there, right there to the left is where we got to park this thing. This is my Scania. I like the blue. Let's get this thing parked so we can call it. So I don't hit the pile of logs. I can't really see back there that far. Mm -hmm. Let me just get this in place, guys, then we can do our final rundown of the game today. That wasn't bad. Oh. Green. Green. And park it. There we go. Uh, okay, so let's see. Recap of the final job. 440 miles, 9 hours, 47 minutes, 92 gallons of fuel, 29,850, over 1,000 experience points. We are on our way to level 16. Let's go check Raphael because he got lost, man. Well, Noah, let's see. Noah did nothing, right? Noah's got two hours left. What did Raphael do? Yeah, so we, we did get it. That was the job he was on from Lyon to Luxembourg. 1,716. I guess it just didn't pop up. I don't know. But he did do it. And then uh, and then Noah finishes in two hours. So we have 110,000 in the bank right now, guys. We have a loan left of 308. Like I says, once I get 200 in the bank, I'll probably take this 100, pay off this loan, because then my installment for the day will go from 5788 to 2888. So I'll be saving 3000 a day in payments, and then I'll pay off the 100,000, and then we'll do our upgrades. But what a successful day today, 110,000 in the bank. Now, if we look at our uh, garage manager, no driver manager if we look at driver manager we go to Raphael, and this is his truck if i try to upgrade it if right now he has a 500 horsepower i could get him the 540 which is going to cost me twelve thousand. what's his transmission at transmission's a 12 speed 
Gotta look at what this does. No, that's not good. The engine with the 540 would give him a little bit more heavy cargo and hill traversal, which that's, I don't think that's worth it. And then the axle, right now he has the... Let's see, this doesn't do much. See, that maneuverability for that was increased a lot. And this was... Oh, look at the heavy cargo change on this one. But it's going to cost me 37000 to get them that. No, I can't do that. I can't, I can't be spending... I, need, I would spend that money on my own before I spent it on someone else's, right? Because I got to look at my Scania... Oh, I gotta visit. Okay. So silly. I can't upgrade mine from here, but I can upgrade theirs from here. Those are all the truck dealerships we found. Uh, these are all the recruitment agencies we found to find workers. Garage manager. Map view. I would have to see where I found garages to buy a garage. But right now, this is the only garage we have in Luxembourg, which I'll probably upgrade it so I can get two more drivers at it. But all right, everybody, I'm going to go eat some food. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate it. Uh, all the new followers, all the new likes, all the new subscribes. You guys are amazing. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to be doing some NASCAR, like I said, most likely Texas, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Keep an eye out for it. Hit the little bells or whatever you got to hit to get notified about it. But until then, enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Stay safe out there, and I will see you on the next one. See you guys.